Rachel and Blackman and Garlic Primary School. This is Evian, my name is Gianna, this is Erin, and this is Chloe. The name of our project is B&G's Jambalicious Yogurt Delights, and our project is based on tropically flavored yogurt. This is our 3D model, which is a dairy farm, and we raise cows so that we can create, we can get their milk. And this is the first step of making yogurt. So once they are milked and their milk is collected, it's carried to this windmill. And this is based on wind power. So when the wind blows, it creates enough power to pump the milk into the milk truck. The milk truck then takes the milk to the dairy factory where our yogurt is made. And so the first step of making our yogurt, and because there are four steps, is the starter cultures. The starter cultures is basically boiling milk, um, letting it cool, and adding our good bacteria, which is Lactose bacillus baracus and Streptococcus thermophilus. And we mix those with the warm milk to make our starter cultures. Boil the water for about 15 to 20 minutes until it forms skin. While you're doing that, you would have to sterilize your utensils to get rid of any bacteria that may be in the extras. Once they're sterilizing, check on your milk to see if it's forming skin. If so, take off the skin and pour your milk into a measuring cup and let it, and let it cool down. In that time, your, your utensils would have been done sterilizing. So what you do is you take out your utensils with tongs, carefully placing them on the table and letting them cool down. Once that has been done, you pour your milk into the touch jars, about three quarters of the milk into each jar, and then you would add one tablespoon of each starter culture in each jar. Once that is finished, then you would incubate them for 36 hours. I'm going to talk about the mango yield, how to make the mango syrup. So you peel the mangoes, then you put them into the pot and let them boil. Then when they're finished boiled, you put them in, in some jars and then let them cool. Okay, now for blending and tasting. For the tambourine syrup, we add five teeth tablespoons of syrup into plain yogurt. For, for the mango, we add seven tablespoons of mango syrup into plain yogurt. For the gooseberry, we add seven tablespoons of gooseberry syrup to the plain yogurt. Then we shake them vigorously to mix together. After that, we taste them to make sure they're nice and delicious and healthy for everyone to eat. The mango yogurt, the ta tambourine yogurt, and the gooseberry yogurt. This is gooseberry flavoring, tambourine flavoring, and, and the mango flavoring. There are the starter cultures. 